Hey guys, it's Saturday morning, February 27th, and this is uh, Kyle, or Vulcan Wolverine, reporting in uh, for the Vulcan Wolverine <laughs> YouTube channel. Um, I thought I would just drive around and see if there's any vehicle stalking. I only saw like two one light cars this morning, two FedEx cars. Um, I did want to say, and I'm going to check this out. Um, like I slept last night and, and target individuals know they, they hit you in your sleep. My back was sore, my chest was sore, um, but I didn't feel that deep, deep burning. Um, and I really think that has to do with the Shungite. Uh, it's really cheap, it's like $25 for a really good like solid pendant, like a kind of a pyramid shaped little solid chunk of it. Um, so it's like $25 for that kind of pendant. And I really think it's it's given me more energy and made the heating less deep of the, the microwave radiation. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna order another one, double up on it and see if it, uh, see if it uh, increases that effect. Uh, so I can tell y'all for sure. That's really an important thing for me. Uh, look, FedEx car right behind me. Can you see it? Oh, I can't get it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. See the FedEx car trailing me? I had a FedEx car with one light uh, earlier. And then I had um, an EMS worker with one light. So they're, they're really participating in the kind of the vehicular stalking. Now, at FedEx, I just see them everywhere. I mean, they're behind me all the time. They're, you know, caravanning me in two. Um, but I really did want to mention that about the Shungite. Uh, I, I really think that is helping with the deep heating of the microwave radiation. I think it somehow soaks it up. Like I've read a lot about it on Wikipedia. There's a the one light car right there. The uh, SUV right there. So I just wanted to get a few examples of vehicular stalking to, to kind of end up uh, my vehicular stalking videos right now. I'll do more, but it's it's better to do them on the fly, like if I'm just, just every once in a while I'll do vehicular stalking, because I think if they know that I do them a bunch, they probably would, I guess, stop it, which would be okay, because I do have a theory, like, with my hat, and I put the little hadron protectors in the lips of my hat, um, last night my friend took my hat just joking around, and he was wearing it, and he wouldn't give it back. And I started feeling this intense pressure on the top of my head. And I'm not sure if it was because, like, the defenses were stopping, were stopping that. And they, you know, it just started to break through. Or if it just deters them. It deters them. They're like, okay, he's got all this stuff on his head. So let's go for his chest or his back or his genitals. Um, so, so defenses can do that, too. They can not only buffer and really work. But they can also deter these guys if they think you've got a lot of defenses and they really aren't seeing an effect on you it will deter them from hitting that spot on your body um, so that's another positive it's not even there's a one light car right there in front so I'm getting a lot of you and there's a one light SUV right there coming down you see that brown SUV right there one light uh, postal worker right there FedEx car still trailing me. Uh, he's turning. Yeah, so I'm, I'm getting a lot of vehicular stalk. I guess my guy, like, I guess all, you know, I guess all of our gang stalkers or microwavers, uh, you know, they, they have to say, oh, we've got him, we're getting him. Oh, my phone's getting really hot. Okay, what this means, like, right now I'm making a video, my phone is getting super, super hot. And I don't feel anything on my body. So what they're doing right now, uh, my theory, which is pretty much 100% positive, is they're hitting my phone because they want to stop this video. They want to stop my phone. And if my phone gets too hot, like a lot of it will shut down. Like the camera will shut down. And it'll have to cool off before it can start again. So they hit, they hit, uh, I haven't seen them hit any more of my electronics that I know of. Uh, with electromagnetic frequencies, I'm sure they have, but my phone, I notice it. Like on conference calls, uh, when I'm talking to other target individuals, it'll get super, super hot. 
um, and then when I'm making videos it'll get super super hot so I think they actually aim the directed energy at the phone and it may increase what the phone's putting out but it also uh, you know it has a threat of stopping the functions of the phone um, so I, I notice that when I make videos it gets super hot and then when I'm on conference calls it gets super super hot uh, like right now it's like hot the back is just like I can't even touch it with my fingers it's so hot um, but I just wanted to make another uh, video on Saturday morning like when I'm sleeping you know I don't notice a lot of directed dreaming I, I had one night of really bad directed uh, dreaming one of my uh, personal defenders went out last night while I was asleep so I think that's why I woke up with more soreness in my chest and my back but it really, it was like soreness and deep, deep down how I, I usually feel a uh, heating from the microwave radiation like uh, inside, inside my head, inside my chest, inside my body. And that's really been cut down for some reason. I've, I've gained a lot of energy and I really do think it's because of the shungite. So I want to thank uh, my commenter who, uh, who offered that up. And I would, I would suggest everybody kind of research that and, and see if you want to get a pendant. It's only $25. Um, I'm going to go ahead, so I'll have two around my neck, around my chest and my head. And I'll really be able to tell if there's a difference when I, when I add that second one on. Um, Y'all know this is really important to me. Defense is really important to me. Even if you're going through stuff that, uh, that may not work so good. Um, it's it's still important because you might hit that one defense like especially those Altera plugs that really make a difference um, and and like I said defense is important for a couple of reasons it's important because it does actually buffer it and it will give you energy it'll stop you from hurting so much it also deters them if it's on a certain part of your body they'll switch over to another part of your body so if you have a part of your body that's just like taxed to the limit like my uh, my left side, my face, like my cheek, uh, and that eye, and that whole left left area, my jaw, um, that they focus on that, um, and so like I want to get stuff over there so it'll deter them from hitting it, and it'll buffer it. Um, also, um, you know, with defense, like I, I really think we should all defend. I think we should all try and make it as hard for them as as we can. Like I said on my defense videos because they'll have to use more resources. Um, they'll have to figure out uh, more ways to, to pump up the directed energy, uh, maybe get more weapons, uh, become a hard target because the more resources used, the better chance that we have of those good policemen and good ex-military catching wind of this. Like there'll be too much going on, too many weapons passing, uh, too much, too many resources on each target individual. So. To be in this, uh, they changed this light just now, turned to orange when I was rolling up to it. This is every time on a light to me. Like, it'll always turn orange and then red. And my right eye started wa watering, so now it's stinging because whenever I, whenever my eyes water or I'll cry, uh, they go for those eyes and it'll really sting them until I wash them out. Or kind of wipe them off with a clean, like a clean shirt or a towel or something. Um, but, but I just wanted to mention that because I really, really think that is, uh, that's affecting it. That's affecting my attacks, the shungite. Um, and I studied it, it said it soaks up a certain type of bacteria. Uh, and then I, and then the commenter, I just, I really want to thank him. I don't remember his name, but if you could comment, buddy, uh, the guy who offered up the shungite idea, um, I think that's a good avenue to go down. I mean, it's just one of many angles that we're going to, like, probably try and go down. I know also stopping this is important. Talking about the technology is important. But defense is so important for me because it buys us time. You know, it keeps us comfortable or to a certain level of comfort to where, to where you can focus and you can fight. Um, in mine, uh, you know, my remote neural monitoring has really picked up, so they affect, you know, my emotions. Uh, they make me depressed or not passionate about things that, you know, I really have always been passionate about, which is sad. But those are the things that I, I am scrambling to defend 
uh, more than the pain. Uh, because you, you sit there and torture me and you don't mess with my mind and I could go forever because of the things I believe and like, you know, because my mind is strong and I'm sure a lot of us feel that way. You know, if they don't feel like they're hurting you enough, they feel like you're too strong and too willful, you know, they'll just remote neural launch in your mind, make you depressed or make you anxious and then their weapons work a lot better. So it's like they can kind of control how, uh, you know, how much something hurts you to a certain extent, you know, your, your willpower and your mind, I mean, you can adapt, become stronger to the, to the kind of uh, microwave remote neural monitoring that they're trying to affect us with. Um, but I was going to take this Saturday morning to, I'm going to upload some videos. Didn't see too much vehicle stalking. I didn't see any police this morning. I think they're having a hard time getting police to uh, be involved in my thing because I haven't yelled.